Hello student, my name is Hemant Rana. I welcome all of you on my channel named Educational Buddha. This is the second part of the chapter Tick 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 of class 4th Math Magic. If you have not watched the first part of this lesson, then do watch it. I will put the link of first part in the comment sections or click on the i button given above. In this video, we will cover only page number 38, 39, 40 and 41. First question, how long will it take the minute hand to move from here to here? Here you can see the starting time is 3.35 and ending time is 3.50. So how many minutes did the minute hand take to go from 7 to 10? Here you can see the minute hand moved from 7 to 10 and each hour interval is equal to 5 minutes. So what is hour interval? The clock is divided up into 5 minute sections. Each number on the clock represents an hour and is evenly spaced out by 5 minutes intervals. You can see here 7 to 8, 1, 2, 4, 3, 2, 4, and 5. There are 5 divisions between 2 numbers. 5 divisions, 5 divisions, 5 divisions, any 2 numbers. You can see 5 divisions between any 2 numbers on the face of clock. And this is, uh, this is called R interval. There are 5 small divisions between any 2 numbers. So, it takes 5 minutes for the minute hand to move from one number to the next to it. That means 5 division, again plus 5 division and again plus 5 division. 5 plus 5 plus 5. How many R interval are there? So here R interval is equal to 10 minus 7 is equal to 3. And each R interval is having 5 divisions. That is why mode minute is equal to 3 multiplied by 5 5 r division sorry 5 divisions between any two numbers and 3 r interval so 3 fives are 15 minutes so 7 se leke 10 tak jane mein minute hand ko kitni minutes lagegi 15 minutes lagegi in another method ending time is 350 and starting time is 335. So ending time minus starting time. So 350 minus 335. So what is the answer? The answer is 15 minutes. So answer of question number A is 15 minutes. Second, starting time 340, end time 4 o'clock. So here, you can see the minute hand moved from 8 to 12. Here, R interval is equal to 12 minus 8. How many R intervals are there? So, A, uh, 12 minus 8 is equal to 4 R interval. Therefore, moved minute is equal to 4 multiplied by 5 is equal to 20 minutes. Other method? Ending time is equal to 4 o'clock and starting time is equal to 3.40. So, our answer is 20 minutes. Here, confusion arises how to subtract. Isko minus kaise karenge? So, you can see here, 4.00 minus 3.40. So, here you can see the 0. So, we have to borrow from here. Yaha se hume borrow karna padega. So, ye this is not minute place, this is hour place and this is minute place. And 1 hour is equal to 60 minutes. So, if we take one hour from here, that is called 1 hour. 1, 1 hour is equal to 60 minutes. So, here we will not come here, but 60 will come. Now, 60 minus 40 is equal to 20 and 3 minus 3 is equal to 0. That is why 
we got this answer 20 minutes yes see starting time 6 5 and ending time 6 15 here you can see the minute hand moved from 1 to 3 so how many are in total are there so 1 and 2 yes here r interval is equal to 3 minus 1 is equal to 2 r interval therefore move minute is equal to 2 multiplied by 5 because 5 divisions between any two numbers so 2 fives are 10 minutes in another matter another method ending time 615 minus 605 so we can get here 10 minutes so answer is 10 minutes question number d starting time 710 and ending time 745 so 2 to 9 okay here you can see the minutes and moved from 2 to 9 here r interval is equal to 9 minus 2 is equal to 7 therefore moved minute is equal to 7 multiply by 5 and 7 fives are 35 another method ending time 745 minus starting time 710 and we can get here 35 minutes also so answer is 35 minutes next question draw where the hand will be 20 minutes after 6 o'clock yes here you can see the face of clock and 20 minutes equal to 5 plus 5 plus 5 plus 5. That means after 12, 1, 2, 3 and 4. 1, 2, 3 and 4. Minute hand shows 4. So minute hand at 4 after 20 minutes. So we have to draw minute hand like this. And our hand shows 6. Yes, 6. यहाँ पे आप देख सकते हैं कि हमारा जो R hand है वो direct 6 को point नहीं कर रहा है, बल्कि 6 से थोड़ा हट के यहाँ पे point कर रहा है. Why? Because 20 minutes already completed by 6 o'clock. 6 बजने के बाद 20 minutes already complete हो चुकी है. That is why ये जो R hand है वो 6 से थोड़ा आगे होगा. Okay, next question. 30 minutes after 8 o'clock, again 30 minutes is equal to 5 plus 5 plus 5 plus 5 plus 5 and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. That means minute hands shows 6, indicates 6, minute hand 8, 6 like this and our hand at 8 here and again you can see our hand point between 9 and 8 kyun kyunki a half hour yahan pe aadha ghanta already beat gaya beat gaya hai 8 ke baad to 8 aur 9 ke bilkul beech mein ye point karega our hand okay next question 10 minutes after 7 o'clock We have to point minute hand and 10 minutes. So first 12 to 5, sorry 12 to 1, 5 minutes and 1 to again 2, 10 minutes. That is why our minute hands points at 2 and our hand points at 7. Our hand points at 7 like this. So this is our आंसर हमें मिनट हैंड को 2 पे शो करना है और आर हैंड को यहां 7 पे शो करना है नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन 15 मिनट्स आफ्टर 5 ओक्लॉक 5 बज गए हैं ऑलरेडी और 5 बजने के बाद 15 मिनट्स हुई हैं सो यू कैन सी वंस अगेन 5 मिनट्स अगेन 5 प्लस 5 10 मिनट्स अगेन 10 प्लस 5 15 मिनट्स that means our minute hands will be there. Yaha par hona chahiye. 3 pe. Yes. Minute hand points at 3. And R hand point at 
five like this so this is a answer next question how long does your school assembly take suppose your school assembly starts at 8 o'clock and finishes at 8:20 so what is the time duration between 8:20 to 8 8:20 minus 8 8:20 minus 8 is equal to 20 minutes so our answer is 20 minutes a uh, school assembly takes 20 minutes next question how long is your lunch break suppose your school lunch break starts at 11 o'clock and finishes at 11:30 So what is the time difference between 11 o'clock and 11:30? So we have to subtract 11 from 11:30 like this. 11:30 minus 11 o'clock is equal to 30 minutes. So our answer: uh, a school lunch break is 30 minutes long. So answer is 30 minutes. Next question. How long is your games period? Suppose your games period starts at twelve ten and finishes at twelve fifty. So, what is the difference between twelve ten and twelve fifty? So, we have to subtract. 1210 from 1250 like this so what is the answer of this subtraction answer is 40 minutes so our game period is 40 minutes long so our answer is 40 minutes is Game period is same as all the other periods. Yes, because all periods are having the same time duration, that is forty minutes. And second questions, the game period and lunch break seem very short, aren't they? Kya game period or lunch break chote hai? Sahi na? No. Our lunch break is 30 minutes long. Lunch break 30 minutes का होता है, and games period is 40 minutes long. 40 minutes का होता है games period. How many minutes can these activities take? Make a guess and then check at home. बॉइलिंग वन लीटर मिल्क एक लीटर दूध को उबलने में कितना टाइम लगता है यू हैव टू फर्स्ट गैस एंड देन यू कैन चेक एट होम पहले आपको गैस करना है और उसके बाद आपको घर पर इसे चेक भी करना है कि एक्चुअली हमारा जो गैस है वो सही है या नहीं है सो आंसर इज अबाउट फोर और फाइव मिनट्स तकरीबन चार से पांच मिनट लगते हैं Second, filling a bucket. So answer is about two or three minutes. Two to three minutes के आसपास लगते हैं. Two to three minutes. Third, sweeping your room. About nine to ten minutes. हमारा room साफ करने में, झाड़ू लगाने में नौ से दस मिनट हमें लगते हैं. Here disclaimer are there. The answers may vary from student to student based on his or her experience. और एक बच्चे का आंसर यहाँ पे अलग-अलग हो सकता है उनके experience के base पे. It is highly recommended that the students prepare the answer on their own. ये आंसर मैंने just for आपके example के लिए बताए हैं. आप इसको घर पे एक बार try करें और इसके बाद सही आंसर लिखें.
let us look at a clock again and solve these questions this is the clock first question the minute hand started from 2 how many minutes will it take to come back to 2 again St started from 2 and after completion of one round of minute hand comes back at 2 again pura ek chakkar minute hand lagane ke baad phir se wo 2 pe aata hai to kitni minute hogi kitni minute lagegi to we already know that the one round of minute hand is equal to 60 minutes so our answer is the minute hand will take 60 minutes to come back to 2 again दो पे फिर से वापस आने के लिए उसे 60 मिनट्स लगेगी and 60 minutes is equal to 1 hour B what happens to the hour hand does it also move how many long will it take to move from one number to the next hour hand के साथ कुछ होगा क्या वो move करेगा या नहीं करेगा और उसको एक नंबर से दूसरे नंबर पे आने के लिए कितना टाइम लगेगा Answer, the hour hand also moves. It takes one hour or 60 minutes to move from one number to the next number. Use bhi ek number se dusre number pe aane ke liye one hour, ek ganta lagega. That means 60 minutes lagegi. Minute hand ek chakkar pura kar leti hai. Tab ja ke humara hour hand hai, wo ek number se dusre number pe aata hai. Look around you and list the activities that take about one hour to complete. Here also, disclaimer, the answer may vary from student to student based on his or her experience. The answer provided here is for reference only. यहाँ पर जो answer provide किए जाएंगे वो reference के लिए होंगे just for example. आप अपना आंसर खुद पता कीजिए कि एक घंटे के अंदर अंदर कौन कौन सी एक्टिविटीज होती हैं। So cooking food, watching a cartoon episode, getting ready for school, playing with friends, doing homework, cleaning of house, completing one small chapter of math, drawing a picture in my drawing notebook next question which games take less than an hour to finish less than an hour ek ghante se bhi kam time kaun si games leti hai finish hone mein so answer is snake and ladders playing cards long jump high jump and Badminton. Dear student, there are many games take less than an hour to finish. बहुत सारी games हैं, वो एक घंटे से भी कम time लेती है finish होने में. This answer is just for example. ये एक example के तौर पे answer मैंने यहाँ show किए हैं. आप अपने answer खुद भी find out कर सकते हैं कि कौन-कौन सी games को finish होने में less than hour लगता है, एक घंटे से कम समय लगता है. Question number two. How long does a football match take? So we have already know the answer. The duration of a football match is 90 minutes. A football match 90 minutes ki hoti hai. Okay, thanks for watching dear student.